Hi, this is Andy Filippiak in Toronto for the week of December the 2nd. As we head into year end, our Canadian permanent portfolio is currently up around 5.8% year to date. Now I'm pleased with this return because our portfolio is very, very conservative. Specifically, we have 20% in equity compared to likely most portfolios, they're 60-40, 60% stocks and 40% bonds. Now 2020, we are going to see more of what we saw for the past 10 years. Central banks stepping in to print money to allow governments to run deficits to try to keep this whole economic scenario going. Now one of the problems is, is that with all this money printing, they have to keep interest rates down because as I mentioned in previous videos, if interest rates start to shoot up, it gets very difficult for the economy to service the debt because of the higher interest payments. So. In theory, we're going to see massive quantitative easing occurring again, and this is going to be buying the bonds that government issue uh, in an effort to keep rates down, keep a sort of a, a lock on the market that way. But the side effect is more and more money printing. And with investors having stocks and bonds, I mean, both are at all time highs in terms of valuations, which means they're very vulnerable to a market dislocation. So just the blueprint that we're seeing going into 2020 should, should have people very concerned about how well their money will do going down into the future. Because in reality, we're just doing what all these banana republic type countries have done in the past, which is monetize their debt, spend, and eventually that catches up to you. Thanks for watching.